This is a brief video about the value of mortars in Iron Cross. Uh, here we've got British mortar hiding in the compound. It's going to support this beleaguered Indian infantry by firing some mortar rounds uh, in at this anti-tank gun. He wants to protect his armoured armored advance. So he's activated his mortar uh, and needs an eight to hit on the first shot. Uh, he scores a hit. That puts a morale marker onto that anti-tank gun and we can roll for the additional morale marker as well. Yep, we got the additional morale marker. So he's on two. And we're just gonna mark that that unit's been hit once by the mortar because Mark's gonna reactivate now. Uh, on, a, on a two plus he rolled a four, so that's fine. Uh, and he needs a seven to hit now. He missed, but he's gonna reactivate again because as Daryl's marking those uh, those mortar rounds coming in, it gets easier and easier to hit. So he's reactivated again, and now he needs a six, and it progressively gets easier and easier. That's a miss, but I think Mark's going to gamble with one more. So I'm going to interrupt at this point. Uh, yeah, it looks like Daryl's going to interrupt. He failed to interrupt. That's a wasted command token. Mark's reactivated. And he needs a five to hit now, and that's another hit. Is he going to cause the damage? He's caused the damage. That's four morale markers on that, on that anti-tank gun, which is enough to destroy it. It is. That's how deadly mortars can be.